Uh, you doing this game, Kev? Uh, yeah, I am. Uh, okay. And I think it should be quite exciting. Yeah, and again, I don't think it's one of those that's uh, cast in stone either. So mine's at minus 145, Herta at plus 390. The draw's at plus 310. The handicap is Herta plus one at minus 140. So even if Herta get beat, you could get a push and get your money back. The total of under or over, over two and a half tells you at minus 135, we're expecting goals, Kev. Yeah, it could well be the case. But I think the thing that's really interesting here is the money line, because I think it's slightly wrong. Uh, I think you look at Mainz, minus 145 is too short. I know that they have a good home record. I know that they beat Hertha 4 nil last season. But I think Hertha are a different team now. I think they've had some positive changes. I think you see the last couple of games, they've drawn 2-2 with Leverkusen, could have won that game, should have got a late penalty and had it denied to them. And the uh, Referees Association have admitted that since, that it should have been a penalty. And I think there's definite improvement there. You look at Mainz at home, they haven't won any of the last three, stretching back into last season. But away, they've been very good. So they've kind of flipped the script a little bit. We're used to seeing Mainz being good at home and terrible away. Uh, and that's not been the case this season. Also, Mainz have got some key players out. Alexander Hack, he's suspended after he got sent off against Hoffenheim. Jonas Hamburkart picked up a, a nasty foot injury, so he's going to be out as well. So they're missing key players at both ends of the pitch. And I just think Hertha uh, have got an opportunity to get something. A massive price as well, plus 390. And remember, it's typical for a Friday night game to have some fireworks. Alex, I mean, this is one of them that you don't have to look too hard to be, find a case for the home side. But this Hertha have got to start performing and also they've got to start picking up some points. Now, this is one they're going to turn up to and think, OK, we can fly under the radar here. No one's giving us a chance, really. And we will, uh, if they perform well, they could well get something. Yeah, it's a difficult match. It's a difficult, uh, it's a tough match to predict. Hertha, obviously, full of confidence after the 2-2 draw against Leverkusen. Mainz are not performing uh, that well this season uh, at home. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Mainz have lost two of their last uh, three in the Bundesliga. It's still their joint best point start uh, to the league season after just six games since 2010, 2011. So, uh, yeah, uh, they don't seem that strong uh, this season like they used to uh, at home, I, I mean, uh, because uh, last season they had a great uh, home record. This season they, they failed to win at home uh, yet. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I, I, I would probably ba back the draw here with uh, if uh, I'm forced to give out a, a bet, but uh, I would rather prefer to stay out of, uh, of this one. Well, yeah, I don't think you're getting any value on the home side, to be honest. So you have to start getting a little bit creative. But we've heard to Berlin at plus 390. Plus one is minus 140. But just going with plus half, which gives you the double chance, is a decent price. Let's have a little look at the official picks. Because if Hertha, remember, they have been competitive in games. The, the problem it's, is also their 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 head-to-head -head record against uh, Hertha uh, on their uh, home soil. I think that uh, in the last seven they are unbeaten, winning four uh, in the process. So that tells you about uh, their uh, home superiority uh, against a team like Hertha. But Hertha, like uh, Kev said, uh, they started good. They started well. They should have won. Uh, they should have won last uh, last weekend against uh, Leverkusen. Uh, what is uh, uh, the the refs are messing with us uh, week in and week out? I don't know what is happening, but in all the leagues, like some crazy decisions. Uh, yeah. Even though they have uh, the the VAR, you know, I mean, this is uh, absurd uh, in some situations. Yeah, it's uh, they've had the voodoo doll out. They found out what we're on, and then they uh, they mess with us. But Hertha plus 0.5 at plus 115. You find that on the alternative markets.